Hey guys, so I'm just going to do a quick video about my thoughts on the new Bell Super DH Enduro Helmet. Um, so I kind of got it in the, the full face mode. We've got the two clips here on the side. The one at the back, which I believe probably gives it that downhill rating. So it's a little bit tight, um, very compact in here, really butted up against my cheeks. Not a lot of space in there, um, but to be honest, I feel super safe in this. I've ridden in it in the DH mode and um, yeah, it, it just feels like a normal full face. Obviously it's a fair bit lighter, but um, it, it's very comforting to know that you've got the, uh, the chin bar ready. So I'll just take off the chin bar and show you guys what it's like. So I think the best way is remove these side guys first, clip them out, and then one at the back. And this one is a little bit temperamental. Oh my god. There we go. Oh. So you gotta make sure that these are clipped out all the way. So in the open face mode, it's quite normal, like a normal helmet. Doesn't feel too dorky, I don't think. Like, you know some helmets, they feel like they're out here. This one feels pretty good. Um, chin strap on doesn't move, well, not too much, I've just had a haircut, so. Got a clip, some clips at the back, well, this adjuster kind of tightens it up, but feels pretty good, like, super sturdy, it's got MIPS in it, um, it's very, obviously it's very breathable in the open air, like, that's that's pretty uh, obvious, um, but it, it does feel very light, and it does, I do feel quite protected with it. Um, the visor, I don't know, like, I feel like the visor's a bit flimsy, like, I mean, it does, I guess if it hits, it's going to move pretty easily, but, you know, like, I don't know, I just feel like if I'm going to land on it, it's going to break pretty easy, but, I guess that's what it's there for. Um, so inside the helmet, got the MIPS, um, got these pads which you can adjust based on your head shape uh, and all your sweat actually traps in here and I think you can remove all of that pad and um, wash it so not not too bad like I've been riding it in summer here in Australia and it's um, it's been pretty good obviously riding it with the the chin bar in place i've done a fair bit of climbing and it's I'm not gonna lie it's not very good um that really tight uh fit with the cheeks and like pretty much your mouth is being compressed isn't the best thing to do when you're trying to breathe and climb uphill so it's definitely one that you obviously take off and climb up um but as you saw to take it off it's a bit of a dicking around so if you're just punching laps quick, it's probably not the best thing to do. Uh, so, I'll show you guys now how quickly it is to put on the, uh, well, to put the chin bar back on the helmet. So let's, let's see how we go. Okay. Chin bar. The chin bar, we've got these little mounts here and this little clip which has to go in there so pull that over try to get it nice and tight and then hopefully these guys have clipped in pull this down Pull the other one down, and then click that in. Boom! That one is, wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. See if I can do this even quicker. So you take it off, oh yeah. Now, you gotta climb back up, and what I noticed with my camelback is 
it's perfect for holding this guy in the back without actually annoying you. So this is a, a Skyline Camelback and it's got this little pouch at the front here which I keep like a tube and I've got a couple of tubes in there actually. But what I noticed, yeah this guy, make sure it's clipped up so it's all in and out, you know what I mean? And then, get it. And clip it in here. Is that right? Looks right. Like that. And just sits. Look at that. Which is perfect. Alright, so the 10 second summary. It's a good helmet. It does exactly what I want it to do. I want it to ride up without the full face chin bar thing. Clip it on, ride down, feel safe. A little bit constricted, doesn't breathe well with the chin bar on. Don't climb with it with the chin bar on, but if you want something that's gonna keep you protected, get one. And thanks for watching, till the next video. If not, I'll see you guys in New Zealand.